Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 16 of Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. Alright, it has been a little while, but I had to replicate exactly what I did after I ended the last episode. Because unfortunately when I turned the game off, I was nowhere near a save point. The closest save point from where I am now was actually where my mummy starts, like right in the catacombs area, so that was a pain in the ass. I still have the first glyph key though, because I remember that's one thing I did. And I made sure to open the door from the other side of the fire room. That way I can get there easily. I don't know if I did exactly everything I did after I ended the last stream, or last session. But the thing was, I was about to stream some Super Mario Odyssey at 6pm Eastern. And it was just a few minutes before 6pm when I was still in the middle of this. So that's why I had to cut the video a little earlier than I would have liked. If I didn't have a stream, I would have just kept going. I don't know how much more is left. But make sure that you don't get the fire put out. Because that would suck after getting all this way. So I think what I'm going to do, and I didn't do this before, I'm going to go ahead and uh, activate the gas over here. And I got to activate it on this side too. There. That will open the door over here. Oh my god, what is this? I see a bunch of lasers. Ow! What, what do the lasers even do? Do they just prevent me from getting the glitch key? I think that's what it is. Or maybe it just resets all the buttons. Yeah, I think the buttons were reset at the time. So I have to get past the lasers and get to the yellow room. Actually, why am I not going this way? Just go in the direction of the lasers. When you get to this part, just don't jump. And the blue part, I think, is a little mixed up. So you gotta be extra careful here. I think the way to the blue room is... Yeah, right over here. Oh man, that was so close. <laughs> So I'm going this way now. None of the lasers are gonna like intersect, so you should be fine. And now we're back in the red laser room. So rather than try to hurdle around and hope that you don't get your signals crossed, just do it this way. Oh no! I tapped the laser, and I gotta do the whole thing over. Oh my god. I just barely brushed the laser. Oh, damn. Well, that sucked. That was a minute of progress gone. Alright, let's do this all over again. Get to the blue laser room. No problem. Seems like the bottom lasers tend to be slower. And that's what threw me off. Okay, now can we finally get the glyph key? certainly hope we can. Oh, whoa, 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 wait a minute. Let me turn the camera this way. A 
Okay, it's in this room. Good. Good, 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 good. That's our second glyph key. I believe you need three to get the treasure. So, that's two down. And two more to go, obviously. Ow. Huh. That never gets old. So I need to be on fire for this one. If I recall. Either on fire or electrocuted. I guess we'll find out. So I gotta wait for one of those. Oh wow, I actually grabbed it. So I remember messing up a few times before. I don't really know what exactly I need. Is it electricity or fire? I hope I chose correctly on that one. Cause that would suck if I chose wrong. Oh good, I grabbed it. Okay, it's fire. Good. I did choose correctly after all. Nice! We got all three glyph keys. So now we can get that treasure chest. Finally! Because you need to put the glyphs, put the glyph keys into the uh, statues. And then we'll put out the laser. All three lasers down, and then we can get the treasure. It's probably a medicine bag. Finally. Oh look, it is a medicine bag! How convenient! Why do I do that Vince McMahon power walk whenever I get a treasure? Continue the, in the castle? No chance in hell. I don't remember if there's like an Egyptian equivalent of hell. I'm sure somebody will tell me. You got the items of the mummy collected in the castle of Uruk. It was just a stolen jewel, and I believe, of course, the medicine bag. Wow, leave me in suspense. This specially lined bag will preserve any delicate medicinal ingredients placed inside. And the third stolen Abydos jewel. You got the 100 Onyx Scarabs that the mummy collected in the Castle of Uruk. Oh yeah, I forgot about that too. Why did that, that vase over there look like a butt plug? <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh wait a minute, maybe I should talk to the physician again. He might just tell me where I can find these herbs. Hello again, stranger! What's that you got there? A medicine bag? Very interesting! It looks like it will have no trouble preserving the healing herbs that you need. Don't waste any more time talking to me! Get collecting those herbs for the mayor! Okay, okay, I'll get a move on. Wait a minute. Where the hell am I gonna find the herbs? Said it was be all over, you know, Abydos. Is that it? But where in Abydos? Ah! Good day to you too. Uh, do you know where I can find some herbs? I got the urge to herbal.
They might just be all over the place. Who knows? Well, at least I can finally save again. All right, let's just look around maybe the regular first part of Abydos first. Those are not the herbs? Oh, wait, those are the herbs. Okay, so they, they're on the ground, and they're just pretty much, like, you know, planted there. I just gotta look for anything that's green. Yeah, there's not really a lot around here that's green anyway. Of course, it would have to be somewhere on the ground. But maybe there could be an herb here? Wishful thinking. It would be a little bit out of the way. It's not there. Okay. Well, we got at least one. And we know what they look like. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, so. Is there another one maybe around here? Very strange that it would pretty much just grow, like, even in rocks. Well, I guess it could be considered weeds. But they're the good kind of weeds. Thankfully, legal here. <laughs> um, let's, uh, guess we gotta go back up again. Strange there was only, like, one, like, right in there. Okay. Let's take our search elsewhere. Maybe around the canal region? They did say that they mostly grow, or maybe they exclusively grow in Abydos. So therefore, it could be just as simple as, you know, zip lining to certain spots. Okay, maybe not that simple. But I gotta look in pretty much every corner, every dead end. Like every nook, every cranny, every orifice. And that's for anything outside of the herbs. <laughs> Okay. Probably wouldn't find any on the docks. So that's out of the question. I pretty much open all the shortcuts. Any around the canal? The canal would seem like a solid place to look. Quite out of the way, if I say so myself. Really isn't one here? Seriously? This would have seemed like a very solid place to look. Okay, I guess I'm being let down. God, oh, there's none near you? Why the hell not? I hope I don't exactly have to find one herb at a time. Okay, no, I don't. Thank God. Okay, that's two. This is gonna be a bit of a frustrating fetch quest. Finding herbs and stuff. Did I already look around here? I think I did. This is going to be a disappointment. I already looked this way. Maybe there's one on the way to the council chambers itself? Yeah, let's look there next. I already got the one here. Um, where else should I look? Nothing on that ledge. Oh, wait a minute. I see one. Right over there.
bit of an awkward spot to grow, but okay. Beggars can't be choosers. Especially if they're sick. Now we're at three. Let's see, if I go this way, will I find number four? I hope I will. That would be pretty good. Maybe number four and number five, and we're in the courtyard. Oh, why can't that be an herb? <laughs> That piranha's not made out of herb, is he? I didn't think so. I guess when they said Abydos, it's probably just like the main area. And not any auxiliary areas such as this. Maybe the, um... Maybe the Chancellor there for the Mayor? Well, I guess it can't really be a Chancellor. Maybe the support would have an idea where an herb could be? I see that you have found some of the healing herbs! Good work! You must find the rest quickly! I don't think the Mayor has much time left. Oh. I'm just left to my own devices, apparently. Oh, game. You have no idea. <laughs> You're leaving me? To find herbs? Of all people? I mean, I was lucky enough to find three, but now you want me to find five in total? You're asking a lot. <laughs> this is not a small place when you think about it. When you have to comb through every spot? It's gonna take a while. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... Spill the beans and be truthful to you. Now I know there's definitely not one here, but I gotta do my intuition and look. You know, just by some divine shock, they actually did put an herb right there. Like, I knew they wouldn't, but I had to see. I'd be doing myself a disservice if I just ignored it. Kinda wish I could just run a little bit faster outside of, you know, the bathroom discs. Alright, let's just look around again! Nope, I don't want to deal with you, okay? Nothing personal. It's just, I got a lot of stuff on my mind. I got the urge to herbal. Remember those commercials, like herbal essences? Like the shampoo, and I guess the conditioner as well? Man, they were really trying for fan service on those. Yeah, my thoughts exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you the first time, alright? Now, where have I not looked? It wouldn't be crazy enough to put one at the well. That would just be dumb. And the sad thing is, I probably passed by those multiple times. And now I don't remember where they all are. Could there really be one in the well? For kicks and giggles, let's look. Oh my god, there is one in the well. See? Well, there's one in the sewer, I mean to say. That's number four. 
Okay, well, that's progress. One more to go! Oh, but it's not in the sewer. Definitely not in the sewer. Shit. It really can't be in any of the shops, right? It can't be in any of the shops. Is it going to tell me to look in every single building, too? Because that is just making things beyond unbearable. I suppose I can just drop off the jewel now. Hold on, did I have an extra monster? I might have had at least one, right? Definitely would not be in the museum, the final herb. Here you go. Astounding! You recover the stolen jewel of Edfu! Ooh, a gold onk piece, thanks. I have 11 now. Ah, oh, wait a minute, I have more. Exo Piranha. An Exo Piranha! Quick and deadly little fish. I'll keep the goofy lizard because I only get one. The piranha can go away. Is that it? No, the wasp spider. Known for its nasty sting. Alright, so I guess we gotta keep looking for that last herb. Oh, this is gonna be fun. God, this brings me back to my Spyro days of looking for one gem. Wasn't that ever fun, am I right? So we'll definitely have to comb around the lower area. That seems to be where I put the worst, the least amount of work in. I'm just bumping all over the place. I gotta be careful. Oh my god, I'm clumsy. <coughs> oh, open the door. Why can't you? Oh my god. I had a bit of an itch there, so I had to like scratch while I was just holding the controller. And it was not work. It was not cooperating at all. Wait a minute. Oh. God damn it. I had my hopes up thinking, was that be it? Oh, now I'm stuck. Where's the fifth herb? Herb. Where are you? Come on, I'm patiently waiting. Thing, but where have I not been? I'm pretty sure the physician didn't have one nearby. What if I zip lined here? Okay, where the physician is, it's there's no solid ground. So that narrows that down for me. I feel like I need to look around here one more time. How could there not be one in this general area? Hello? Hello? Anybody there? Herb! Come on, Herb! Here, Herb. Come on. Come on, Herb. Well, that sucked. 
I'm not gonna find an herb around some electric eels. Let's be honest. Let's look around here again. Let's think about this. Like, I didn't... I looked there and there was nothing. And I'm pretty sure going over here is not going to yield any results. so many times it's starting to get boring I've run out of things to say oh my god <laughs> kind of wish Snoop Dogg was here he know where to find some herb and they're just as medicinal Alright, I'm just gonna take a couple minutes because I'm getting a bit annoyed, so I'll be right back when I have an idea of where it is. Time out. Okay, I'm back and I was starting to think about it. I went to the courtyard and I found nothing, but I saw a bunch of lanterns. And I never bothered to hit them. Because there's no electric eels around the general area, is there? I don't see any. What if I actually tried to hit them? You know, if I can actually succeed, there we go. Gotta make sure that fish is not getting me. So I think something might happen if I hit them all. Did I get them all? Or maybe I ran out of time on one of them. Yeah, that one is still there. Oh my god, please tell me it wasn't in a chest. You can't do this, game. You can't seriously tell me that it was in the chest the whole time. Oh, it's a glyph key. Wait a minute. I did see a door in the council chambers that required the glyph key. Suppose this may not even lead to an herb. But at least it'll lead to some area. It opened up those sluice gates. Ruby, what? What? <coughs> the herb was here the whole time. Hi. Oh, it died in one hit? For real? What if I wanted to capture it? Oh, 100 gold scarabs. Don't spend them all at once. Well, I actually won't be able to spend them at all. Yeah, they die in one hit, so you can't capture them. Alright, now that I got the all five herbs, we can save the mayor. Then maybe I should be his running mate? You know... I think I earned it. Well, I guess I'll know way to find out. Look, I'm gonna make sure that you're safe, so I'm doing this for the God of the Dead. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent! You found them all! If we hurry, there still may be time to save the mirror. Oh. 
Come now, Mare. You must take this. It will make you better. Oh. <sighs> oh, what happened? Where am I? Oh, I feel so dizzy. Who is this? What is he doing here? Mare, this is Sphinx. He is the one who found the ingredients I needed to cure you. He is our hero. He saved your life. Well, thank you very much, young sir. You're quite a strange looking fellow, aren't you? What brings you to our beautiful city of Abydos? A sacred crown of Abydos for Anubis? Hmm, that is indeed a significant request. He is lying, sir. He's the imposter who poisoned you. He wants to steal the crown. Anubis would never consort with such a creature. Don't trust him. Silence! You leeches have been seeking the crown ever since you joined the council. This sphinx has already proved himself more trustworthy than you. Hmm, this difficult decision requires some deliberation. Why is everyone so interested in the crown these days? I must think. The best course of action... Sphinx, join me next door in a few minutes and I will inform you of my decision. I need to think. And I'm so tired. Wait, where's next door? Just literally the same way I came? That sounds about right. Aww. Above all, the people of Abydos expressed their sincerest thanks for the good deed you have done for this city. I've done many good deeds. Remember the piranhas? Our fair city has been growing, has been going through a most turbulent time recently. It seems that some higher power is determined to bring misfortune and misery to our lives. Your arrival and heroic actions have been like a ray of hope to the people of Abydos. Thus, the council have decided that the sacred crown of Abydos will be entrusted to you, on the condition that you deliver it to us, deliver it safely to our Lord Anubis, and express our warmest regards to him. What? You cannot give him the crown? He is clearly an imposter. Anubis would never endorse the actions of one such as he. <laughs> the crown is ours. You are not going to give it away to anyone, you stupid fool. Why did I just stand there? Come, brother. The crown is ours. As for you, Mayor, your short-sightedness is secure. Oh, oh raw almighty. Please, someone must stop them. The trains are escaping. Please, Sphinx, I implore you. Retrieve the crown. Alright, alright, fine, I'll do it. Just give it another while, because I'm planning to end the episode here, okay? Alright, so in the next part, we gotta go get that crown from those crows, or vultures. Anyway, see you later, everyone. Thanks for watching.